Welcome, my friends. I'm Peymal Motahede, the president of Freedom Law School, which I founded in 1996. I'm going to share with you now how the IRS has been trying to take down Freedom Law School for 27 years without success and how you can learn from that and you can be free. You can have peace of mind from the IRS attacking you because you can learn from Freedom Law School's successes. Okay, well, let's go to our website at livefreedom.org. Okay, where I've been saying for a long time that there is no law requiring 99% of Americans to file and pay the federal income tax. Okay, there you go under the victories page and the, the drop down menu and go to Freedom Law School Victories over the IRS and open that link in a new tab and it takes you here. And on this page, folks, when you open it up, okay, folks, it tells you very simply. That the IRS since 1994 started an investigation of me as a potential fraudulent tax protester promoter. Yes, folks. I'm going to zoom in on this so you see this big, folks. Okay? That's right. Since 1994, IRS has looked at Freedom Law School and me as a potential fraudulent tax protester promoter. Actually, before there was even a Freedom Law School. So when you click here in the bottom the hyperlink right there, there it is. You see the documentation on this page. And the documentation here, again, it shows that they were looking at me as a potential fraudulent tax protester promoter. You see a language right here on this highlighted areas of this 1994 case history worksheet of the IRS on me. And you see in the hot areas, whether the agent says he received the case from manager in the first line in the top right here on this page, and the Sue Gary of the Irish's Criminal Investigation Division, you know, is the one that was a contact person. And you see the name Sue Gary here. We are from early 1994, continuing through May 1994, and going to 1995. This investigation continued. And guess what? They cannot stop it because since then, and still, even though they label me a tax protester, as you see right here, I've been exposing IRS fraud, the deception. Here is a, some great cartoons, folks, of exposing IRS a scam that deceived you to be a brainwashed slave. Yes. And here is my favorite cartoon right here. You see right here how they got, got the American people brainwashed to be a slave. Yes. Watch this video, folks, that comes up <clears throat> you know, in the description below, in the card above, explaining all this, folks. Yes. You don't have to be a slave. You can be free if you free yourself of their deception. I've beaten them. I've been under investigation. I'm still under investigation now. After 27 years, then they cannot stop me because it's all First Amendment activity, free speech, association, press, assembly, petition the government for redress of grievances. Watch the video in the description below and a box that comes up for more details how you can be free with confidence against the IRS crooks just like me.